doing? What you doing? Hmm? Oh, they came on for a second. What's on again? Hold up. Hold on. Where are you going? Where are you going? So it's, you, they, you guys can hear me, right? I think they can hear me, but they trying to oh they said no holly now what okay now now i see both of them on there sorry guys what what what, <laughs> what is happening <laughs> I... okay, hey. hold on both good both okay both good. Good. all right okay. hopefully fingers hey. crossed Okay, you want to mute that? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I just All right. did. All right. Oh, okay. this is like third time's a charm, right? Yeah, I hope so. Third time's a charm. It is moving <laughs> so slow because I see myself. I'm like watching a one of those foreign movies where you, I can't, I can't. It's so Same. slow. Just not on the Zoom here. Me and you, it's delayed. It's so delayed. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, like, it's like one of the Japan and me right. Movies. Like, it's like we're movies. watching Godzilla. <laughs> it's so bad. Okay. All right. Um, I'm going to share a screen because we are going to do the new image stuff. Oh, we have sound. Thank you guys for being troopers with us while whatever techno technological, <laughs> technologically impaired. All right. So here. <laughs> awesome, Annie. It happened just so you could finish dinner with cleanup. Yeah, there you okay. go. I'll work out. <laughs> so while I had no news, or while I had no news on, while I had no sound, I was trying to entertain you guys with the animals, and that was Lucy Lou. That's my new powers. puppy. She's nine weeks old. She's a mini Bernadoodle. So her mom is, her mom is an eighty-three pound Bernese Mountain Dog, and her dad is a seven pound Mini Poodle, and she already weighs seven pounds. So I was thinking, like, she's already the size of her father. <laughs> <laughs> she's super cute but she's a puppy and she wants to chew the entire world um but she's super cute and loves all of us and she's my little shadow uh oh all right so hi irma betsy annie connie silver fox had to leave catch you later irma everybody who follow us over here gail thank you guys and thanks for all the messages 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 <laughs> And Thanks for just letting us know what was going on. Connie, she was saying small screen. I brought over the OBS so I can look at it there. Um, I'm hoping everything is good now. Hoping. I don't know why that is weird because we can hear each other just fine through the Zoom. But it was just mm -hmm. something was happening when it goes to YouTube. And it's still bad. My video is so delayed. I can't look at the little Zoom photo at all. <laughs> Alright, um, so let's go ahead and look at some new stuff in Design Space. Something special for mom. Yes, because that's this weekend, guys. So happy Mother's Day to all you moms out there. Oh, this is cool. So it's mom, and then it says it's got editable things in there for like the kids or whatever. Oh, and you can customize it with their names. That's yeah. awesome. There's one I really like too that I've seen in one of these mom ones and it's like flowers and then the stem of each flower is the name. So it could say like grandma's garden and then it'd have the flower and the stem was the name of each grandkid. That's cool. Yeah. That's I think a Lucy lot in my family. To bed again. I'll try to grab her again at the end for anybody who didn't see her, but she was tired. The 
grandchildren thing. That would be a lot of money. For me. That'd be a big car. Oh my goodness! How many flowers would be in that, Alex? <laughs> well, uh, I'm 28 of 32 grandchildren. Wait, say that again. 28 of 32 on my dad's side. Holy uh, cow! <laughs> like a birthday, like it's constantly a birthday in the yeah, family. Yeah, it's ridiculous. You know the, how they have the family calendar? Have you seen that? I, I made a post about it not too long ago because my mother-in-law has one. But it has the family and then it has a hook for like each month and then you yeah. put little with the birthdays. That I would love to see your if that was done for your grandma. It would be insane. <laughs> You'd have to make like a hundred little pieces. Yeah. <laughs> because especially now with like married in, second, third, I, I don't even know all their names. <laughs> oh, and the Mike for Mom thing's still going on. So if you guys haven't bookmarked your five, you just go into the Mother's Day thing here, and oh, there was a link in the old video. Um, but you just bookmark your five favorite images, fonts, or bookmarks, and then you're automatically entered to win a hundred bucks from Cricket. So if you haven't, just go ahead and bookmark. These are take a trip, so there's a lot of different luggage tags here. Oh. It's a good place to do the monograms. Yeah. It makes them look all fancy. Trending on social. Oh, that's awesome. Mexico Mother's Day on May 10th. Well, happy Mother's Day to your daughter, Gail. Oh, for my daughter-in-law. So they're just a couple days different than our Mother Day. That's interesting. I love my, what does that say? Gay. Oh, I thought it said day. I love my gay sons. I only have one, but I love him. <laughs> oh my gosh, that gets me anxious. The class of 2020, the graduation yeah. stuff gets me so anxious because I was like, oh my gosh, it's a couple weeks away. I don't know why, but this bothers me so much. I know what it says now, but it just bothers me. Finished. <laughs> and I'm like, that's not how you spell that. So <laughs> it's like I get what you're doing, but it's like at the same time, it's like spelled so wrong. <laughs> yeah, Gail. Yes, yeah, so that's all you do is you click on when you go into Design Space. You go into the there's a tab for Mother's Day things, and it's got you know make a treat for mom, make a a gift for mom. You just pick any five Mother's Day images, projects, or fonts you like. Bookmark them. And then that automatically enters you in. And then Cricut will reach out to you by the email you use for Design Space. So literally all you have to do is bookmark. Say, Alex, just bookmark one for fun. Oops. So you love that one. Bookmark it. Choose five and you're automatically entered. That's why I said it's literally like the easiest Cricut giveaway ever. It's so easy that people think it's not like there's more to it, you know? I, I have to say the Clementine song. It's a really sad song. Oh yeah, you told me about that. I didn't have any clue. I can't Oops. like any of these because only moms love them. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Order note. Close to my heart art booking. Okay. Excuse me. Okay. No, it's not just the fonts. It can be fonts, images, or projects. So when you go to the home page, which maybe we can show Alex, can we show because they're all wanting to know how to enter this contest? Um, yeah, uh, I think. Can we can we wait until yeah, that's through this and then because I don't know if we'll be able to get back to this without the link. So oh right, gotcha. Projects you'll mush. You'll over. look over with the mushrooms. Little mushrooms. Speaking of mushrooms. I was going to say, speaking of mushrooms, Alex's video of putting the mushroom gnome card together will come out like within 10 minutes of us getting off of here. It's actually uploading to like YouTube as we speak. And I just have to finish the description of it. Um, but yeah, sorry it took so long. My iPad ran out of storage and that's where we edit and save everything. So we had to get a drop. What is it called, Alex? A uh, external hard drive. Yes. So we didn't lose everything that's on the iPad. So then with getting the external hard drive, it took a few extra days. So we're a week 
a, a week farther in, but uh, celebrate. What is a a p i? Uh, oh, what is that? Why celebrate a a p i. That's a good question. I mean, I know they have their contributing artists, but right. I don't know what the a p i stands for. Um, let's say it's for amazing artists, uh, participation. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> then you forgot a letter, too. <laughs> <That's a tie>. <laughs> <laughs> Pineapple. Some flowers. Oh, this is cool. Oh, yeah, that's neat. I like this shoes kindness. It's nice. Yeah. As a oh, mother. it's for your keyboard. Skull Gamer keyboard. That's fun. Wait, so it goes on your keyboard? Uh, I would think so. It's W A S D. Oh, so you can just print them and put them on. Oh, yeah. okay. Recent community projects. Happy birthday, dude. And all the info for the Make for Mom contest, too, you can find in any of our Facebook groups. I forget Design Space it is pinned in the featured, so you can find it there. And it has the links you click on to go bookmark and everything. I like that rainbow reflective iron on. I'm going to be doing a video on that soon. Mustache weird. Brush. What is it? Big beard? Big beard. Oh, a brush. Oh, that's cool to like put on your mustache. Yeah. Do you use the mustache? Uh, what is that a brush? Brush, right? No, because my no, there's no point for my beard because my beard is not like anybody else's beard. And I, I, I was taught when I got my hair cut, I was talking to my barber and she's like, I just want you to know your beard is not like anyone else's beard. Like, she's like, she only cuts guys' hair, and she was like, no one else has a beard like you here so, <laughs> I have a weird beard that my beard hair is like hair on top of your head like it's it not, is it's so soft it doesn't look like it but you have, I was like what it is like Matt's beard hair is so coarse and yeah. it tricks you you know when you touch it but Alex's is so soft it's like you condition it, <laughs> like, <laughs> it it's but it's like that's just the way it comes out of my face <laughs> <laughs> Look at this that image that Shadow Punk is really cool. Oh, yeah, look at the like little. That. Oh, Doc would love that a little grumpy kitty, the graduation grumpy kitty. Yeah, that's cute. Awesome, Tammy. Post, Tammy um, just got the auto press ordered, so she's gonna use some of that reflective iron on on that. Oh, these are neat. I love that, like the mosaic one yeah there's a bunch of other ones like that click the little three dots on that one alex and do the similar images because i'm hoping it's brings up the other ones yeah you've seen the view similar images does not hi lucy lou you're coming back around i thought you were going to sleep what were you doing it's got to be something on my end because this stuff is loading yeah. So slow. There we go. There we go. Oh yeah, these are super neat. Super cool. Now the similar images will work on everything except for editable images. So if it's an editable image and you click view similar, it won't pull anything up. Neat. Cards that pop. Hey, okay, there's the mortar board. I just posted our. Remember the one we did last? We did it together. You were yeah. here. Yeah. Did that yeah. hats off? We could We couldn't figure out which way it uh, folded. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Come here. We're like, how does this make sense? Come <laughs> oh, here. Oh, we can't play right now. We have business to do, ma'am. We can't just always pop and play. Aw, poppers. Hmm. <laughs> Look at her poppers. Oh no, she's so spoiled. She hasn't been home alone. She hasn't been alone yet. <laughs> what? What do you want? 
Like we went to the pet store and I love that it's Pride Month coming because they have all this rainbow stuff. Can you believe I found a rainbow unicorn sloth? <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> I said, oh my gosh, it checks all my boxes. <laughs> so it is. Do you like it? She likes it too. That's good. Where are you going? Where are you going? I can't believe how much she's grown in like a week. She was so shy at first. But not anymore. Not anymore. Where are you going? Lance. <laughs> Puppy whimpers. What do you think? Which one do you like, Lucy Lou? Do you like the plants? You could eat them. All of them. You could eat. <laughs> yeah. Because they're paper. <laughs> She'll try to eat everything. The whole I, house. I look classy things. Ooh, new to design space. Ooh, that's a really neat one. That graduation explosion box. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, bookmark that. That's a very cool explosion box. It's not working. <laughs> Alex looks so classy. He does. And he's got a good tan going on. I was like, Alex is tan? Yeah, I spent... I went to a lot of different beaches in the last couple of days. Monday, that sounds amazing. Monday and Tuesday, I went to St. Augustine Beach, Jacksonville Beach, every beach in between, down to Daytona Beach. And then <laughs> Sunday, Saturday, I went to my friend's pool. Friday, I went to the pool here. And the pools here, I forget, are heated <laughs> to like 70 degrees. So when I got to my friend's pool, I was like, oh, I'll just get in the pool. I'm like, this is like stepping into Lake Michigan. It's not, <laughs> it's not warm at all. <laughs> it was so cold. I was just freezing. They're like, sorry, Alex, you don't live in the villages. <laughs> <laughs> We definitely have videos of how to use the mug press. Uh, if you look up, um, if you search on YouTube, you could do uh, Melody Lane and uh, mug press, and you'll see. Yeah, there's a, lot a of bunch buttons. of them. Don't be scared. Oh, it's so awesome. fun, and it's once you start and you you actually make a mug, you're like, wow, that was easy, and then immediately you're like, <laughs> what else can I do? So I've, I've even done ones where you're using the, the pens, the infusible ink pens. Yeah, which are really cool. Yeah. Especially, you can have kids draw on the laser paper and then put it on. <laughs> it makes you feel like you're a child because I was literally like, <laughs> I like printed out a, a design and then I drew, like colored it all in with the, is it the colors. Witch one? It is, yeah, the witch's brew yeah. one. It is. It's fun. And like I always say, once you get the mug press, you turn into like Oprah of mugs, and you're like, you get a mug. Man, you, you get, get a mug. mug. <laughs> for everybody. <laughs> but it's awesome. And I love the infusible ink on them. I yeah. love it. Yeah. My hero is a veteran. She dreams. Yeah. She dreams she's more than she sleeps. sleeps. Did we tell everybody my weird dream I told I was that? just, since we saw this, I feel like you have to. So, okay, everyone. Hold on. I've been having weird dreams lately. I dreamt to Martha Stewart. I don't know what's going on, but I had this dream. I'll just share. We laughed about it so hard the other day. We woke up Matt telling, I was telling Ducky about it because we were laughing so hard. So I had a dream that I went to Papa John's to pick up pizzas. It wasn't my Papa John's because there was a drive through I don't like Papa John's, not going to lie. Anyway. I get in the drive-thru and I'm like, hey, I have two pizzas to pick up. And then I was like, oh, but I, I already have a pizza from you guys. And they're like, so why, if you already have a pizza, why? <laughs> it's going to sound so weird out there. <laughs> so if you have a pizza, why did you order, why did you order these two? And I opened the pizza box and it was a pepperoni pizza. I remember this. And I take the pizza and cheese and pizza slide down. I throw it on my chest. And I look at them and say, pizza cloak. <laughs> <laughs> and they instantly 
like very disturbed and they shut the window on me and they won't give me my pizza. <laughs> but what? I just... I call it a pizza apron because we woke up because I was telling Ducky about it before I told Matt and Matt was sleeping and we, he literally got up and shut the door because we were laughing so hard. He's like, I heard you talking about pizza apron. <laughs> I like, pizza apron. That's hilarious too, but... Ducky was laughing so hard. She's like, "We should just do that. Like, <laughs> can act that dream." I don't know. It was very bizarre. And I woke up and I was like, "That was weird." And I just kept repeating to myself, "Pizza cloak," because I didn't want to forget the dream. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so weird. Oh. I like just no bad days. Yeah, that's pretty. Is that a fairy or is that an angel? Right, it's one of the two, it's right? A goddess of nature. Oh, there we go. She's a goddess. I like that flower. I like the skull. Oh, yeah. The pencils in the different... That'd be good with the new skin tone iron-on vinyl. Those pencils, because it yeah. comes in all of the shades. These are shade. pencils, too. Oh, cool. Oh, I like the rainbow letters. Can we bookmark the rainbow letter? <laughs> Just the one. <laughs> It's, well, yeah, I, I can't. That. It's you not can't. letting okay. me. It's <laughs> Cat Madeira. I'm probably butchering that last name. So. <laughs> so now I want pizza. Just don't put it on you as a cloak, Sue. Yeah. <sighs> Best birthday. Well, it's already. I know we're losing time because we had all these issues. Um, you want to go ahead and then jump into the image sets? I'm not sure how many image sets there are. Yeah. Because it's already, it's 247. Absolutely. Oh, and Patreon members, we are having our murder mystery. I was going to say dinner. It's not a dinner. It's We're having dinner. our murder mystery event in Zoom tomorrow at 2 p.m. Eastern. So if you want to come in the Zoom and just watch it, because I know everybody that signed up for it already has their parts, which I'm excited. To, did you get your part, Alex? I got it. Um, oh, my gosh. This is not, I haven't looked at it yet. Uh, yeah, so it's interesting to see who everybody gets, but we'll be doing that, which is fun. We had so much fun last time. Hopefully I do better. I feel like I took too many notes last time that I almost couldn't pay attention enough because I was constantly writing. So I'm going to try taking less notes this time and see if I'm more successful at figuring it out. <laughs> I don't know if my, if I can, actually. Nothing seems to be working on my Cricut Design Space. Oh. Um. Andres. Oh. It's not letting me do anything. I do, Gail. I do remember my Martha Stewart dream. Um, although I don't oh I don't remember what was all in it. I just know I, I woke up and was like, I had a dream with Martha Stewart, but I don't know what it was about. Okay, I'm gonna stop sharing for a minute. Uh, okay. I think they should make a show. I came up with this after this dream because I was like People have funny dreams, and what if there was a show where people told their funny dreams, but then they, like, animated it, you know? And they could call it In Your Wildest Dreams. I think it's a great idea. <laughs> I like it. Okay. I think I think I got this one to work. Okay. Images. Image set. I definitely have that dream, and then my Jerry Springer dream, where I was um, I was at the Jerry Springer show in the audience, and somebody started giving birth on stage, and I went up to deliver the baby, and the whole crowd was yelling, Jerry, Jerry, as I was delivering the baby, so Sweet. that could also be a great episode on In Your Wildest Dreams. Well, not an episode, but a clip. I had a dream, but I don't remember it now, but I remember posting it on Facebook, um, so when I find that, you know, I think that would be an interesting one. <laughs> I, I I really need to write down the dreams because I have some weird dreams too, and I do want to say I'm on um, my account. So like if you so my on the Alex Cato account on Kirka Design Space, um, there's I don't have access. So the prices that you see, if you see the little green little A, well it's a white A, but the green little banner. Um, 
it, that's access, and then if without access is the price over on the other side. Yeah, and these Marvel ones and the Guardians of the Galaxy, they are from previous Less. mystery. Yeah, yeah. Mystery boxes. Mental health. I can't wait to see. I love Guardians of the Galaxy. Did you see Guardians of the Galaxy Not 3? Not the new one yet. Not the new one. I want to see it, though. It's hilarious. Your anxiety is lying to you. <laughs> <laughs> it does. His beard looks fabulous. Huh. And his hair. You just got another haircut the other day, too. Yeah. Good things take time. Like a well-trained puppy. <laughs> At least she's sleeping more than two hours now. She was only sleeping two hours at a time for a while. Now she's, I got her sleeping like four hours. And she found her way into our bed because we have steps at the end and a bench because we had doggy stairs because Bella couldn't get up. Um, so now she's like, no, you're not putting me in the crate. I'm putting myself to bed. <laughs> and she's happy there. The world is a better place with you. Oh, that's great to put in a card to send to someone. Just like yeah. a thinking of you, the world is a better place with you in it. Thoughts are not facts. No is a complete sentence. <laughs> That's interesting. It is, but... Crafting is my self-care. Oh, break the stigma with the butterfly. I like that. What is toxic positivity? I don't know. I, I was just literally thinking, like, how would you? That's, like, a really good question. Can you be too positive to where it's toxic? I don't know. I don't know. think that's a thing. I don't <laughs> think that's possible. What are your guys' thoughts on that? Because, like, if you're annoyed that someone else is being positive, that's on you. That's not on the person being positive. Like. <laughs> right. Right. It's okay not to be okay. Yeah, these are great for someone just having a hard time, yeah. you know. Grow positive thoughts. I really like that one. I mean, if it said stop toxic negativity, that totally makes sense. And I agree a thousand percent. Well, maybe if it's insincere. That's a very good point, Tammy. When things change inside you, change things around you. Yeah. Tomorrow needs you. That's just a good statement, period. Tomorrow right. needs you. Take care of yourself. All vibes welcome. I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's true. Uh, what if it's at most? Most yeah, vibes welcome. Yeah. <laughs> Wedding sentiments. Wedding crew. Her hottie, his hottie. Mr. Steal Your Heart. It's so funny. The, you know, the, the fiancés are all excited about this. Like, oh, I'm going to make him a Mr. Steal Your Heart. And then he gets in and he's like, do I have to wear this? <laughs> Love you always. Yeah, because it is wedding season. Yeah. Oh, I like the You Are My Greatest Adventure, though. Yeah. That's great for an anniversary card, anything. I would really like to go to a wedding. Nobody I know gets married ever in life. I've only probably <laughs> been to a handful of weddings in my entire lifetime. Really? I... Yeah. My kids have never been to a wedding. I've been to too many, I feel like. Well, Connor was. He was like, he was less than a year old. It was Matt's cousin. Um, but no, nobody. Lots of people do a lot more eloping, too, in like destination weddings and stuff. Just because yeah. the price of things are insane. Connected happy birthday. Yeah, 
You say it's your birthday. Do -do 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 -do. Don't get that song stuck in my head. <laughs> <laughs> Probably already happened because it's one of those. It's actually no. That's not the song that I thought of when you said that. What were you thinking of? The Disney song "You're Welcome." Oh, from Moana. Yeah. <laughs> my favorite song in that. <laughs> You're gonna get it stuck in my head too. <laughs> birthday with the shark. Shucky, shucky. Another one, there was one that had a sewing machine, one that had a hammer on top of it. Uh, oh, yeah. It was up all the Yeah, but it would just work for. Oh, that one's got a mermaid tail. These are neat. The wine glasses, I love the little llama pinata. Nice. So there's a whole bunch of new happy birthday ones to use. They're all connected. Oh, is that? Oh, it's connected happy yeah. birthday. Oh, let me see. Graduation cap. Yeah, so it's easy to make, to make it out of cardstock vinyl. Oh, these are for the graduation caps. Tassel with the hassle. Not all schools let you do this. And my kids will, Connor has not, I was like, can you find out if you can do this at your school? I just really think he's like, mom's going to decorate my cap if I say yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Doggy wants to decorate her cap, though, if she can. Oh, uh, that's awesome, Connie. Her friends got married last Saturday, and their music as they were leaving was the Star Wars theme song. Can't do it. It's too much for me. What? Because I've been to a Star Wars wedding. It was too much. My cousin Amy. Wait, the one that was Ducky's preschool teacher? Yeah. Oh, yeah, Miss Amy. She loved her. She's so sweet. She had a Star Wars wedding. We had, we had lightsabers when we walked in the reception. <laughs> That seems very un Amy like though. <laughs> like, I mean, I didn't, it was it was funny because if you meet Ducky her husband, was, his Alex's cousin actually was Ducky's preschool teacher. I know some people just think my daughter's name is actually legally Ducky because that's all I call her. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I should explain. I named her Ducky after Pretty and Pink Ducky because she was always dressed like a rainbow and she marched to her own drum. Um, but her actual name is Madison and she goes by Maddie. What is Festa's wedding does? Um, ooh, maybe Gil's, no, Gil's daughter lives in Mexico. What was it again? Festa's Juanina's. I don't know. Or Juanina's. Is it like, those are like little clowns? Are they clowns? I thought they were. Scarecrows almost, right? They look. Am I crazy here? The scarecrows, yeah. I'm so confused. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna look it up. Festa Juanina. And it wasn't Fiesta, right? No. It's Festas. It's a celebration. What does it mean? Okay. Uh, it's a set of religious celebrations that is mostly popular in the country, but also has become prevalent through Brazilian cities. Ah, so it's Portuguese. So it's seen as an occasion in urban centers to celebrate rural life. Okay, so like farm life. Okay. So it's like 4-H, but not in Mexico. Right. I see. That makes sense with the scarecrows. Yeah, and it wasn't Fiesta, so I was like... It's not Mex Mexican, I think, so I think it's Portuguese. Yes. If it's Brazilian. Oh, I see. Okay. I love how cricket covers, like, all of We've learned so much just on different yeah. nationalities and stuff through cricket designs. Family tree designs? We are just talking about this. Oh, I made my mother-in-law years ago for Christmas. I made a family tree like that. I just designed it all and put 
I put a little bird for each his mom and dad, and then a heart, and then it had the leaves with the different all the different kids and grandkids on it. That's really cool that there's all these to choose from. And you don't have to read it. And if anybody needs a last minute like Mother's Day gift to uh, somebody, you can cut that out of vinyl and put it on a. And then, do we see this shabby chic camper phrases? No, we did not. We did not. Oh. Campers have s'more fun. That's cute. I wish I had a camper. That would be so fun. No, there. I don't think that's true. <laughs> no, because um, so Callie's husband, they clean campers, and oh yeah, uh, like detail them and stuff, and they're actually in the shop like a lot. It's, if it's you, like a boat. Yeah. You know. Yeah. And they're fun to rent, but they're not fun to own. I always wanted one. And then they have the fifth wheel one. I want one too. better just because they don't, you don't drive those, so it's not as much that goes wrong. But then you got to have the thing to pull it. So if you don't have something big enough, then you got to buy right. the thing to pull it. Right. Oh, that can't more worry less is really cool. Yeah, I like that. It should say can't s'more. Like, some more, you know? Yeah, that's too much. S'more. <laughs> <laughs> How do you make your s'mores? It's the important question. What do you mean? How do you make theirs? Isn't there? I mean, isn't there the main way? Like you roast what the are your, What are your ingredients? Marshmallow. Well, usually Hershey's and then graham crackers and marshmallows. Wrong. But we did start doing it with Reese's peanut butter. Yes, milk. that's the correct way. Is that it? Yeah, <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. And then how do you like your marshmallow? Like everybody, some like it barely, like my oh, has It's got to be on fire, black. Yeah. Me and Connor are the same way. We like our marshmallows crispy. You got to yeah. catch it on fire a couple times. <laughs> Duffy likes hers like just barely turning brown. Oh. We like ours where they fall off the stick too many times. <laughs> yeah. We like, oh, and yeah. then you lose the marshmallow. <laughs> One of my favorite memories of camping with the kids is like we were doing s'mores and Duffy was probably like four and she had marshmallow all over her hands and we went to walk to the bathroom and and uh so we grabbed hands and our hands are just stuck together you know because marshmallow yeah and then we were singing that sugar land sugar land song uh so however howl that song is stuck like blue oh that yeah yeah with her. simply daily household planner charts bunch of different Household planners. Yes, people love their planners. Yeah, if you have a lot of time to use the camper, that's great. We wouldn't be able to use it that much, so it wouldn't be worth it. But I also want to do the thing where you rent a camper. Like, we've talked about that many times. So you yeah. can rent the RV and then go on a trip. I like just... <laughs> my car is still set up with a bed in the back. <laughs> <laughs> Alex says, my husband is like, I would live... Like, he, he would like... He says he would live in an RV, you know, and be okay. I don't think he really would. It would close in after a while, but... Yeah. I like the simplicity. I like this play one play two thing. Oh, that's neat. Partner in crime. Oh, so it's got two different sides, so you make something. Yeah. Oh, I get it. These are best friends things. Oh, the peanut butter jelly. I want to get... A, a tattoo of a little penguin right here on my the side of my hand mm -hmm. with like his little wing up like giving a high five and then somebody <laughs> have another one that's awesome puppy is knocked out she's just sleeping at my feet oh I'm sorry my feet and stepped on you and then these are licensed $69.99 Marvel what is the Falcon and the Winter Soldier? Oh, I have not seen well. I don't even think I've heard of that one. That's good. Groovy mushroom party decor set. Wow. That's a lot of dots. <laughs> that is a lot of dots. Amaze. A 
rainbow maze. That's a, fun. You can put that in a car. A Sudoku. Have you ever played Sudoku? Yeah. I did it like a couple times. And so those was... are those were the three brand new sets actually. The Iron Man, oh, okay. the Winter Soldier and all that. You did play Sudoku? So yeah. Sudoku. I did it a couple times. Um, hold on a second. Um, I didn't see the fun in it, so it wasn't for me. <laughs> You're like, this just hurts my brain. Yeah, that was more so the, the situation. Um, oh, Gail said, how are the cats getting along with Puppy? Cats are getting along great. So the two of them, Jax and Plumps, um, I figured Jax would get along with her really good because Jax and Bella Rosie were besties. So Jax likes to play with her. He'll literally like get his tail going just so she'll, and she'll chew on his tail and he doesn't care. It's like, if she bites down hard, then he'll be like, I'm moving. Um, but she pounces to play with her and Potter, Plumps, that's Plumps. And, but our mama cat is just, she's still in like the, I'm gonna, I'm gonna act like you don't even exist to the puppy mode. Um, but the other ones are fine with her and play with her. She loves them. She's like, you're my plaything, and I'm gonna play with you. And she does. Mamas will come around. She usually sleeps right next to me in bed and she's been a boy. She won't even get in bed. She's like, um, puppy, no. <laughs> But she's getting closer. She's coming out more. Up to the puppy. Bye, Carol. Have a great weekend. Have a great Mother's Day. And a lot of people are planting flowers this weekend. Oh, that's so cute. The happy birthday puppy dogs. Aww. My friend just, my friend's dog. It was just Ernie's birthday a couple of days ago. We got, um, at Petco, we got, Petco or Petsmart, I always get them confused, but we got a thing where you bake the dog a cake and it's obviously like for a dog and Ducky, yeah. she's like, I'm going to bake the puppy a cake, but she hasn't made it yet. But I'm like, how much is, the puppy can't eat much. Oh, that is so cute. The puppy coming out of the cake. Yeah. Handle on his head. Oh, little wiener dogs. We uh, stopped in Petco. She had to get shots yesterday. And we stopped in Petco to get, I had to get bedding for the guinea pigs. And we carry her. We don't put her down because she's so young. We don't want people touching her. But the Petco people were like, is that a Bernadoodle? And I said, it is. And then we left. We hear the guy going, we've never had one of those in here before. <laughs> <laughs> he was a little celebrity. They were like, oh my gosh, it's a Bernadoodle. So funny. Cosmic Bride. Whiskey. Bound. Veil Bound. Bound. That's funny. That is a great shirt for a Nashville bachelorette party. Yeah. Right? Yeah. A lot of these. One Last Rodeo, y'all. Bougie Cowgirl. Bye, Connie. Have a great weekend. Space Cowboy, Just or Space Cowgirl. I feel like these were pretty much made for National Bachelorette parties. Yeah, yeah. Well, this what is weird. The oh, Cheryl, a Bernadoodle is Bernese Mountain Dog and Poodle mixed together. So her mom is an 83 pound Bernadoodle. She's a mini Bernadoodle because her dad is a mini poodle. Little x-rays. <laughs> Little doggy x-rays. That's weird. <laughs> Retro cowgirl bachelorette t-shirts. last ride for the bride if you follow me if you uh if any of you want to be friends on facebook it's holly k-l-i-e-n i'm the only one because it's k-l-i-e-n 
Uh, but you can find me there, and then you can see all the pictures and everything of the puppy. And I'll post some in the Patreon group, too, because I know a lot were asking about it. And they're like, will you keep updating us? So we'll post some in there. But my main Facebook page will have a bunch. Because she's my new baby, you know? It's like having a... It's like having a baby that just teases and chews your whole house. <laughs> yeah. What's I say? Batch or... Batch four. I don't understand that one. Batch tour. Oh, tour. I thought it said four. Gotcha. That does make sense. It, those are called, the St. Bernard Doodles are called, I think St. St. Bern, I think they're called St. Bernard Doodles, so it's really close. Um, they said she'll get 25 to 40 pounds. Well, mini Bernard Doodles tend to get 25 to 40 pounds, but she is a girl and her mom was bigger and they kind of estimate, they do this, this calculation by her weight now, her weeks, and then multiply it by 52. And it's estimating she'll be 45 and a half pounds, which is perfect for us. These so angry kitty designs. I love these. Oh, there's the, I like the one with the walls of the rain. <laughs> it's like Grumpy Cat. Remember Grumpy Cat? Yeah. <laughs> with the rainbow, just the. <laughs> That's so funny. Halloween candy. Oh, Halloween candy. It was like, what is that one got going on? Uh, a standard one gets, what do they say, like around 70 pounds? The standard, because a Bernese and a standard poodle are both large size. So they get around 70 pounds. Uh, she's actually seven pounds now, so I was saying, because we took her to the vet yesterday, and I was like, she's as big as her father already. <laughs> That's weird. I don't even understand how a seven-pound dad and 83-pound, you know, Bernese work, but... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> even the vet was baffled, which really surprised me. She's like, hmm. <laughs> I was like, oh, I thought you... <laughs> <laughs> Grumpy Cat does not like decorations. Grumpy Cat would tear all the decorations down, right, Johnny? You've been booed. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're thinking. That's we're, that's the only thing that makes sense to us. Yeah, that's uh, yeah. That's what the vet was thinking too. They must do. My dad goes, "You just put the whole dog inside him." <laughs> <laughs> And it's like, do they just hold her? Is there a lap? <laughs> like, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, ding, ding dong ditch. Ding that used to be a thing. You know what? You can't really ding dong ditch now because no, everybody's it's got, got ring cameras. cameras right? yeah. yeah. People like to do it in hotels still. I've still been like where they want to knock at the door and then you run just away. Boop, 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 all the way down the hallway. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. Mm -hmm. I know you ran away. It's <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny. Oh, but this is cute because do you remember they did, it was like two years ago, they did these things called getting iced or something and they would bring, randomly you drop off a basket to somebody's house and they had those. What are those drinks? They're called something ice. Smirnoff ice or whatever. Okay. But then people would, they they had this locally too where people could sign up to get ding dong ditched. And then um, people would put little baskets together and they would have all different stuff. Snacks, some would have whatever. And then you could put your address if you wanted to get ding dong ditched. And then random strangers would just ding dong ditch each other. But you would leave a, a basket with like gifts in it. Which was actually a really cool idea. Yeah. Some people were putting a ton of money into those. They're like, oh, I'm doing 10 of them tonight, and they're showing their baskets and all their stuff they're putting in. I'm like, holy cow. Doodle movie cinema. Did we see these? I thought we saw these. Bye, Tammy. Oh, that's fine, Connie. They like glue sticks. They eat the weirdest things. We 
saw these though, right? The movie stuff? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Alright. Oh, it's 2.15 already. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta go pick up Tom from school in ten minutes. I Holy know. Cow. I was like, I gotta, I gotta go get stuff at the Airbnb, and then I gotta go to Orlando. Oh, well, everyone, thank you guys for joining us, and don't forget, Patreon members, we are gonna be in the Zoom tomorrow. Come in if you're not participating and just watch the. Yeah. Oh. One I'm film, you can try to figure out the merch mystery yourself. Not ready for it. <laughs> You don't know your character yet. What if you need to get some gear? Uh, I I think I have enough stuff here that you I'll, do. Just, you I'll do. change <laughs> it. I'll change my character. <laughs> so Alex actually got to, last week, got to meet several of our Patreon members. We're actually in the villages, and he got to meet them and go out to dinner, which was awesome. I really wish I was there. Yeah, it was a good time. Everybody had a good time. So, and that video will be coming out uh, after I pick up Khan and I'll get back, it'll be out so you guys can watch Alex put together his his little hipster gnome. Yeah, my little hipster gnome. I do love that gnome, and I love how happy you get. You're like, look at him. <laughs> <laughs> but it's just like when you design something, you're like, look, I did this. <laughs> <laughs> right? It comes to life. I know. I love that. So. All right, guys, we will see you. So if you're in the Zoom, we'll see you tomorrow. But if not, we will see you next Friday. And we have, we'll have we have several videos coming out, too. I worked with the new dissolvable tape, the new writable labels. I'm going to do something with the mug press. So uh, there'll be a new one coming out for that, too. All right, you guys. You can't, oh, my gosh. I was like, you can't see me, but I'm waving. But it's so <laughs> delayed. <laughs> you guys all have a good Mother's Day weekend. Toodles, y'all. And toodles. I said toodles. Happy oh, crafting. Darn it, I missed it. <laughs>